Good morning, class. Welcome to the online class. We are continuing with chapter one, Medieval Europe, Rise and Spread of Christianity for class seven history. So today I'm going to discuss the topic, the barbarian invasion. So the word barbarian means basically uncivilized, uneducated, or savage, or wild. So what do we mean by the barbarian invasion? So the term barbarian refers to the nomadic tribes. So barbarian means they are nomadic tribes. Nomadic means what? Wanderers who wander from place to place in search of food, clothing and shelter. So the term barbarian refers to the nomadic tribes of Asia. So we are talking about a place called Asia and Europe as well as Germany. Now when you combine Asia plus Europe you get Eurasia. Eurasia is a place where you have Asia, Europe and Germany. So this is the place where this barbarian used to live. Okay. So the term barbarian refers to the nomadic tribes of Asia, Eastern Europe as well as parts of Germany. So who were called barbarians? To the Romans, anyone who was not a citizen or a subject or a nagric, okay, of Rome or who did not speak Latin language was called a barbarian. There were five major barbarian tribes. Uh, barbarian tribes are also known as Germanic tribes. G-E-R-M-A-N-I-C, Germanic tribes. Now, who were these Germanic tribes? They were called, okay, by many, uh, there were five Germanic tribes, okay, so namely five Germanic tri tribes were there, okay, who were they? They were Huns, H-U-N-S, Huns, who belonged to the Central Asia, okay, France, from France, okay, and basically Vandals, S A X O N S sections and Visigoth. Okay, Goths. Now, Goths have two tribes. Okay, one is Visigoth, Visigoth, and another one is okay, basically O S T R O Ostrogoths. Now, these Goths and Vandals were very very powerful. <coughs> And they were the real barbarians who basically, okay, caused the decline of the Roman Empire, okay. And this, all these Huns, Franks, Vandals, Sanctions and Goths basically hated the Romans because, because Romans treated them very cruelly, okay. One important reason for the fall of the great empire, the great Roman Empire, was the continuous attack by these Germanic tribes, okay, such as the Goths, Vandals, Franks, okay, Huns, okay, not Huns, but uh, uh, but sanctions, uh, etc. Okay, so one important reason for the fall of the great Roman Empire was a repeated attack by the various Germanic tribes, such as the Goths, Vandals, and the Franks, and these attacks are sometimes called barbarian invasion okay the barbarian attack on rome basically came from the what was the cause of the attack of the barbarian invasion okay now i am coming to that point why did the barbarians attack rome the main cause or the root was okay the mass movement caused by the Huns H U N S Huns Huns were basically led by the king name K I N G king name A T I L L A Attila okay now now Attila basically raised military campaigns or operations okay to win lands of the barbarian tribes or Germanic tribes and these Huns were basically okay ally with the Romans they were friends with the Romans they wanted to win the good side of the Romans so they in order to win the good side of the Romans basically they drove or they chose uh, they chase the barbarians out from the lands <clears throat> 
so in order to win the land and in order to win the gift of wealth from the romans these huns basically ch basically chase the germanic tribes like the vandals goths franks etc when this eurasian warrior that is called the huns which came from the central asia okay basically okay cause destruction and disorder in the northern europe okay they drove many germanic tribes to the borders of the roman empire so what happened was okay romans okay basically allowed these germanic tribes like the goths vandals franks or sanctions to settle near the borders of the roman empire but unwillingly because they did not like these germanic tribes because they were called barbarians okay so what happened was they did not like this okay barbarian tribes so they unwillingly okay basically accepted that they can sit near the border area of the roman empire but they were treated very cruelly okay according to historian okay one of the historians that basically lived in that age okay this this historian basically cited an example that romans basically okay treated the goths okay goths are basically barbarian tribes okay very cruelly okay and he told that okay the starving goths had to trade their children into slavery in exchange for the food the food was a dog meat so brutal behavior of the romans basically created a dangerous enemy within their own territory or within their own kingdom when the oppression of the romans or the when the domination of the romans became very very okay uh, very very aggressive okay what happened was the goths could not accept this domination for a very long time so they rose up in revolt against the romans uh, under a goth king named king a l a r i c alaric and with the help of this king they were able to throw or defeat the romans in 410 ad after goths attacked the romans okay after the goths attacked the romans under the kingship of alaric okay in 410 ad then it was again attacked by the vandals and after vandals it, it was attacked by the saxons and basically the western roman empire basically was declining was in the stage of falling apart or in the stage of disintegration so with the western roman empire weakened or becoming weak okay germanic tribes like the vandals and the sanctions basically took the opportunity to basically overthrow the romans from britain spain and north africa in north africa in 455 ad <coughs> finally in 476 ad the germanic leader okay of the okay goths okay tribe basically he was known as ostrogoth okay ostrogoth okay ostrogoth tribe okay for goths tribe known as ostrogoth tribe there was a king named called okay uh king named called oda odo eser okay who basically okay gave the final defeat to the romans and removed the king or the emperor called romulus augustus from the throne from then on no roman emperor emperor would ever ruled again from a post of the throne in italy so this was the final battle in which the romans were completely defeated and the western roman empire was completely weakened and okay basically it received a death blow in which ad 476 ad okay the first attack was in 410 ad then after that vandals and sanctions attacked the romans in 455 ad then the third attack was in 476 ad which basically completely destroyed the roman empire okay deposing the king okay romulus augustus okay removing the king romulus augustus and after that no roman king ever ruled italy okay leading many historians to okay 
quote as evidence that 476 AD was the year the Western Roman Empire suffered its death blow. In this period, Visigoth adopted Christianity. So the king Alaric was a Visigoth king. So he belonged to the Visigoth tribe, whereas King Odoacer was a Ostrogoth tribe. And this both the tribes basically belong to the gods. Okay, they were the they, they were the tribes which were able to basically okay overthrow the Roman kings. Are you understanding? So in this period, okay, Visigoth adopted Christianity and translated the Bible from Latin into a Gothic script. So Bible was tr translated into a Germanic language. This Germanic language is known as Gothic script. Now, we are moving on to the decline of the ancient Roman Empire, okay? What do you mean, Decline of the ancient, A-N-C-I-E-N-T, ancient Roman Empire, E-M-P-I-R-E, Empire, okay? Now, Whenever we are talking about decline, decline means the fall or a downfall of the Romans, okay, or a defeat of the Romans. What was the reason for the downfall of the Romans? So, the first reason is frequent, okay, rebellion. F R E Q U E N T, frequent rebellion, okay, or rebellions, okay. Now, Frequent means often, again and again, okay, Roman Empire was attacked, okay, by the revolt, okay, by the uprising of the people who were unhappy with the rule of the Romans, okay, because they have conquered their lands, the Romans have conquered their lands, okay, and they basically hated the Romans, so frequent attack is one of the reasons. The second one is, okay, constant warfare. Now, whenever we are talking about the constant warfare, we are talking about the continuous warfare, okay, by the Romans against this barbarian invasion or barbarian tribes, cause, okay, lots of spending of money as well as wealth of the royal treasury. And also, in order to maintain the huge army, they needed money. So, this constant warfare was another reason for the downfall of the Roman Empire. The third one is bankruptcy. R-U-P-T-C-Y, rupsy. Now, bankruptcy means, okay, lack of wealth. Lack of wealth, okay, in your banks, in your pocket, etc. So, bankruptcy due to high cost for defense was one of the reasons for the downfall of the Roman Empire. The fourth one is, okay, the barbarians served as, okay, Roman uh, army. So the barbarians were basically, okay, employed in the Roman army. So they knew, okay, about the Roman style of warfare. Okay, they had information or knowledge about how to how the Romans fight. And this was one of the fatal, okay, fatal defects that you find, okay, of the Romans because they basically included the barbarians in their army and this was one of the major downfall of the Roman army. Our Roman Empire because Visigoth okay Visigoth king known as Alaric okay basically was an ex army okay soldier okay who led Visigoth tribe okay and invaded Rome in 410 AD and he was one of the major reason for the downfall of the Roman Empire okay so the barbarians served we served as okay Roman army. Okay, now I am writing in the small words. Okay, now the fifth one is unemployment. No unemployment. Now, whenever we are talking about unemployment, we are talking about lack of job. Okay, 
अनइम्प्लयमेंट लैक अफ जब अफ द वर्किंग क्लास न हू आर वर्किंग क्लास ओके हू वर्क फर वेजेस लाइक लेबर्स ओके इंडस्ट्रियल लेबरर्स एंड मैन एंड लेबरर्स ओके बेसिकली दे बेसिकली वर्क इन अ डे एंड बाय द एंड ऑफ द डे दे गेट मनी दैट इज कॉल्ड वेजेस ओके नंबर सिक्स इज वैल्यू नाउ वैल्यू मीन्स वॉट इन नेपाली इट इज कॉल्ड मान ओके worth okay in english okay ideals now idea now whenever we are talking about ideals values ideals okay and customs now i am writing short words there on the blackboard so what is values value means man or worth ideals means others okay others the idea of being perfect and customs means traditions of the romans basically Uh, had a fall or a downfall or a decline when life became cheap cheap means low price by killing okay another person okay in the battle so romans were very cruel because of the cruelty okay their values their customs their basically ideals were declining and this was one of the reason for the decline of the roman empire okay number 7 over reliance on slaves now they over depended on the slave okay or slave labor as roman's economy depended on the slaves to till or to okay farm the land okay and work as craftsmen besides treatment to the slaves okay the cruel treatment to the slaves led to rebellion or revolt okay which further weakened the roman empire this was another reason okay number 8 reason that we are moving on to is okay rise of christianity okay so when we are talking about christianity was one of the major cause for the decline of the roman empire rise of a new faith helped contribute to the empire's okay fall because Romans basically basically wanted her kings to be worshipped okay their kings to be worshipped and the christians did not wo- wanted to worship the roman kings they wanted to worship their god that is called lord jesus christ so the christians basically believed in uh, worship of only one god and romans did not like it this was one of the reasons for the fall of the western roman empire okay the ninth okay See, so this is Christianity. Okay, and I T Y Christianity. Okay, the ninth is basically okay. B A R B A R I N, barbarian invasion. Now, this was invasion. V A S I O N, invasion. Okay, now barbarian invasion was another reason which further led to the decline of the okay Roman Empire. However the decline of the Roman Empire had far reaching effects or influence like it had okay an adverse effect okay or far more reaching effects on latin learning greek learning or greek language learning and when you don't learn that language you don't use that language so the and the use of latin language itself declined the decline also led to the confusion in western europe also because there was no king to rule the throne so there was confusion there was chaos okay there was disorder in the empire and at the time a number of small states okay small states means small independent kingdom basically rose uh, when the roman empire declined this was the okay downfall of the roman empire hope you understood this lesson okay or the topic with this okay i've finished this topic and i'll be moving on in the next time okay with brazilian empire or eastern roman empire thank you for listening